Hey, Dark Souls fans. Um, welcome back to Casey Tries Coffee. Today we're actually going to be making a fun little thing here. I got this card. Half an ounce of the gingerbread syrup. Half an ounce of the peppermint syrup. We went a little crazy, but that's okay. About two ounces of the coffee mate. Um, yeah, whatever. I went over. Shut up. Made a second one for my wife. Am I right, fellas? And I gotta wait for another five minutes. So this is a cool thing I've seen some British guy do where he fills it first and then like stirs it and then he pushes it down out halfway. And that's just kind of neat, right? Because then it's like all the water down here is getting some uh, a little bit of brew time. Respond to this TikTok with your favorite Fortnite dance. Now, the image here does have whipped cream on the coffee. Um, it says I can garnish with whipped cream, cinnamon, or nutmeg. Um, but I'm not going to make whipped cream because we don't have any. Um, so this is just going to be the purest purest form of the recipe. Okay, thank God we're done. Oh, give it a push. Okay. Don't talk to me until I've had my coffee. Okay, next we gotta do eight ounces of coffee. So, here goes eight ounces. Oh yeah, oh that's gonna be so good. And, oh, right on the money, look at this. Damn. Of course, we gotta give it a little stir here. Ooh. All right, let's see. Oh, oh my God, hang on, here we go. Oh my God, that's lovely. Mmm. I'm gonna give that one a 10 out of 10. You get, I mean, the blend is, is beautiful. It's, the vanilla creamer does actually help. So you get like that vanilla peppermint gingerbread flavor. Um, you can barely tell there's coffee there, but there is, and it's not, it doesn't taste burnt or charcoal-y. Mm. Oh yeah, it just provides like a little background note. Um, yeah, that's a 10 out of 10.